I'm Audrey, I'm with Sidious Mag. Congrats on the race. Uh, take me through it. Yeah, my goal going in was just to compete. Um, and my coaches kind of said that this was in my range to win. So I kind of had to like wrap my head around that first. And then once I did, I kind of just came out here with the mentality to win um, and compete. So yeah, I think it went well. I think the pace lights sort of slipped away. Um, and that's when I tried to focus a little more on effort um, to make sure that I had you know, a kick and um, energy going into the last four. I know, you, I know you talked to us prior on, on flow track and you kind of told us that like you liked a pro race because you'd be able to just like kind of slip in the back and let them carry you through. That's not what happened here. You <laughs> led basically the entire time and then you kicked to the end. Like how was that different? Like once you actually got to the start line then having to kind of change that approach there? Yeah, I think I was pretty quick off the line um, and I was kind of expecting everyone to go like super quick out of the gates. Um, and then I ended up in like first place. So um, that definitely switched a little bit of my mentality. I kind of was, you know, before I was kind of um, just gonna go with the plan to like stick in the pack. Um, but yeah, it's not how it turned out. I think I think it was fine. Um, and like I did like an okay job like shifting, um, you know, great strategies on the spot. And what's it like competing against high schoolers one weekend and pros the next? Yeah, it's definitely um, interesting. Honestly, I was more nervous for the uh, New Balance Indoor Nationals than today. Um, and I don't know why that was, but I, I felt really calm today um, before the race and confident. So, yeah. Do you have a routine to help you like get calm? Um, I'm still trying to figure that out, to be honest. Um, but yeah, honestly, like I put in my noise canceling headphones and, um, you know, especially if it's like a night race, I really just try to take my mind off it, literally pretend I'm not racing and then, you know, obviously once I get in the car, kind of start visualizing and whatnot, but yeah, still trying to figure it out. This is only your first race of the Apple season, just so a week after you set that new record at New Balance. What's now, you know, the plan for you going forward? Yeah, honestly, like I told this other guy, I, I really don't have any plan, um, but yeah, I mean, I would just honestly, like one of my goals, like I'm would like to take, you know, like three seconds off my, off of this because that's pretty close to the um, trials uh, standard. So that's, that's one of my goals. For me, I'm not really sure yet. How excited are you for NC State? I'm so excited. Um, I could go on and on about this, but yeah, I just, I love Coach Hennis and she was actually going to be here today, but she got sick and um, yeah, she's just awesome. And the girls are like exactly, you know, my type of people. And, it's a very, it's, it was like an unbeatable environment. So I just like found myself, you know, coming back from Raleigh. I went twice and every time I was like, I want to be a part of this like program. It's so special. Um, but yeah, I'm very excited. You're talking about that qualifying time. Um, is the Olympics like a goal for you? And if so, like how do you prepare for it? Yeah, the, the actual Olympics, I don't know. Maybe um, 2028, that's what I'm hoping. But um, yeah, I mean, there are so many, incredible athletes competing um, for obviously that 1500 spot, those three spots. So it would be very hard this year, um, but eventually in the future, yeah, I'd like to go. 